Hello. I'm Damien. And I'm Ganian. And it's the war against Gigas. Earthbound. I'm not sure if I've ever sat through from here myself, unless we did that the very first day, which we might have. I don't recall. I guess we didn't just do this. Just, this is Earthbound! With its cool thing that you don't usually see. I don't know. But what I have decided right now... Is this probably okay to actually watch this intro thing now? See, like, not that you would know that ahead of time. But, like, that summer's right there. Like, immediately, like, these are... In a later game areas, what you do in game? I mean, that's just a bus. So that's fine. That is one of those things too. That I, uh, I, I think about it often times. Uh, riding the bicycle. I think about the that kind of thing often times with the whole. Uh, spoilery situation and whatnot, that it's like, well, you know, some things, the spoiler is almost more in the reaction people have to it. Because if someone truly don't know, then certain things may or may not actually be spoiler, because they won't necessarily know, unless that person is me. In which case, uh, the brain will work too fast, too frequently, and we'll immediately extrapolate, like, oh, that was a big spoiler, that was just done said. And it's a, it a problem. <laughs> That was it, though. That's how we missed every time. Uh, so, when last we left off, we recorded the final Shoundstone location. Technically, we recorded more than one, but that was the last one. Last thing we did, and then the sound slowed. I guess it didn't explode. We do have it with us. But by obtaining all five, all eight location melodies, um, shouting happily, I transported to the realm inside our mind, Magic Hand. And now we're here. And things happened. We're in our jammies. Are you an ATM? You are, that's what I thought. Doesn't matter right now, because it's just a faint memory. It's not a story or anything. Look at the sun! Face the sun and smile! Look at the sun! Face the sun and smile! Look at the sun! I guess they're all one entity. Instead of all. But yeah, so we got a, we got a magic camp to go through. Hello, shop. Well, it specializes in puddings and pendants, heck yeah. As I have a mild hiccup inside my, my, my body. Okay, earth pendants might be good things to get. I, um... Without purchasing one, there is no way to know what do. So I've got a handy-dandy little, uh... Item list already open right over here. I'm just gonna... Probably went the wrong way. Yeah, these are all, these are all the items. Uh, no, don't need weapons. I would like, uh... There we go, pendants. This is not a big order though. Earth pendant. Provides protection from flash, freeze, and fire. And most of the defense up by 16. How is that compared to the C pendant then? Flash, freeze, and fire. Ah, but uh, defense 20. How much space do I got? I got one space. Joy, because I, I want to buy two of those and store them. <laughs> oh, well, we can buy one. I believe magic puddings. I mean, I can find that right here too. Why not? Scroll. I'm pretty sure it's just a thing that uh, restores PP, though. 
Uh, yep, recovers about uh, 40 PP. 40 Pippins. Okay. So purchase unto one Earth Pendant. I didn't mean to equip it. No. No. I can't use that to equip it. There we go. But, you know, with only half chance that we can, you know, bring all this stuff out of our brain, then, uh, you know, we can just go ahead and, uh, yes, store. Can we store the soundstone? No, I should hang on to it. That's, that's fair. Can I store the ATM card? I should hang on to it. That's, that's also fair. And I can't store that. I could store that, but I don't want to. Three bags might be a lot, I guess, maybe? Uh, but we are alone in here. Hey, yeah, yeah, fine, let's... No, I, I want that back already. I've changed my mind. What if we could ride a bicycle in here? No, give me the bag of Dragonite. I mean, if we wind up opening, like, a box or something later and getting equipment, we can just throw away the old equipment. It's not like we're running short on money. Earth Pendant. No. No. Goodbye, Mr. Demon Shopkeeper Man. I'm just gonna go, uh, store that as well, in my mind. His store. Good thing. Okay, thank you. Bye bye. Hello, Damien. Did you learn how to tell the, what time I'm indicating? Possibly vaguely two o'clock, because it's not quite three o'clock. But that's not really high enough for two o'clock either. So I don't know. It's hard with a 16-bit sprite. You kicked my butt badly. I won't forget. Oh no, bad feel. At least it's not killing my eyes. You destroyed my pride. Rawr. That's kind of gross, but okay. Hey, it's Magic Hand. No problem here. Well, let me if I get in front. Thank you for remembering me. It me. I'm you when you were younger. Hey, let's play ball. Do you prefer reading comics or playing games? What? You busy? Yes, I'm sorry. I'm very butterfly. <sighs> I'm very busy. Busy heckin' wondering what these people are all lined up for. Yeah, long time no see, Damie. Wah, Damie, let's play. Damie, a pokey took me snack. That old pokey's a bitch. La 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 la. My name's Nico. Let's run and sing and dance. Fresh. Kya kya. Peace. We haven't played together lately. I'd like you to take your time, because this country will disappear when you wake up. Oh. Goody. There's a present, though, with a PSA caramel. A delicious, delicious caramel. I know the name of the girl you used to like. And this is why we let you melt in winter. Summer. Uh, after winter. Please rest. The dream you have here is a dream within a dream. Your heart knows things you aren't aware of. You want to sleep? Okay. No problem here. Okay. I didn't need to sleep, but I was curious if something was going to happen from it. Oh, good. It's you. I'm going to talk to the snowman. We had fun one snowy day. I melted, but I'm still real in your memory. Oh, Jamie. You're so lucky. I envy you. I have no luck. But Damien, 
Uh, okay. Let's be friends forever, alright? Hell no. This is Buzzbuzz's tombstone. He appeared earlier in the game and gave up the ghost before he achieved his goal. Sadness. But what's in here? Flying man. I'm your courage. I follow here in Magic Hunt. My name? Let's say Flying Man. Flying Man joins you. We have another Flying Man. Did you want to talk to me? I'm sorry, there's really not much to say. Which is what they say when you already have a Flying Man. Ba, 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 da. It's, not, it's not a full song, it's just this little loop. Life is but a moment, a fleeting grain of sand. Stars are at the universe. Some something in hand. You mean I don't remember the song very well. <laughs> Damien, I still feel pain where you wounded me. Apparently I hold on to a lot of uh, negative uh, emotion with regards to the enemies I fought. A sheer Eden is filled with ultimate intelligence. You can't go there unless you're truly ready. It's a place where you can touch the universe, the truth of the universe. Going there may bring sorrow. Okay. Well, welcome to possibly the Sea of Eden. I don't remember if this is, this is probably what this is called. Butterfly. There's me with a, with a box. I want that box. Butterfly joined me. Oh dear, this is where we have to fight question marks. Unknown figments of our mind. And a present. Fight me, present. Hello, loaded dice. You're not actually a dice, you're a die. That's you, a flying man. Hey, but the flying man does uh, really useful, helpful things. He can take damage. And he can die. And if he die, he get a tombstone. Hey, me. I found my cap that you lost. I'm so stupid. There's lots of junk in my black backpack at a time like this. Why don't you get rid of something I don't use? Okay. Um. I guess, uh... Consume. Ooh, recovered nothing. I found my lucky cap that you lost. I got the baseball cap. Pretty sure that's garbage. Yes, it is magic ant. Yeah, that, that's just an old baseball cap. Hey, me. Just, uh... Watch this. Yeah. yeah that's what I thought. Uh, that, damn it, I already have three bags of Dragonite. Ow, that hurts my eyes. I, I need to not look at the ground while we're walking. Yeah, I'm gonna go spend all the time to store one of those. I wonder if staying at the end would heal Flying Man. Life is but a moment, a fleeting grain of sand. A song that lights the universe or something, something grand. This is probably Star Not Song. Yes, I know. I know the Sea of Eden's over there. I want to store one bag of Dragonite. Okay, thank you. Bye bye. Should have kept that, but I'm pretty certain there's at least one item that we need to actually pick up. And I need, I mean, I want to. But I'm sure the game will have other other uh, plans in the store. Okay, on the off chance that it actually does heal him, even though it probably doesn't, because he's probably akin to Teddy Bear. Let's let's try to sleep anyway. Oh. All right, flying man, let's go back to the Sea of Eden. Let's 
excuse me, Manly Fish and or Manly Fish's brother. And we're here. Um, I guess let's go this way. I was surprised and happy that it was a present for a moment, but it's a load of dice, so... Good charge. I can't stay mad at that. That's fine. Good job, Fabi. Thank you for being inside my mind. Ah, oh, that's a real present right there, which means I went the wrong way, didn't I? Yeah, no. Uh, are you a thing that explodes? No, you're just a thing I don't like a French kiss of death. Man, why are you doing poisoning me? Yeah, you deserve that, Smash. You are but a like button to me. Oh, baby. That rocks. 10 PP. Much of which I spend sucking poison out of my body psychically. I should fight me. Slow down. Oh god, Garfield's eyes. There's a goddess band inside. I'll wear that. Hell to the yes. Get out of here, diamond band. We don't need you. We'll just litter this priceless mental sea of energy. Sorry, I saw a butterfly. Man, that's a lot of things over there. Let her fly! Kinda wish the fly man didn't have footsteps. Hello, loaded dice. Oh, uh, that's an electro, electro switch. I don't like that. Good charge. Good smash. It wasn't a smash. Oh, you sent a greeting. That's okay. Have a greeting back. And forward we continue. Okay, what kind of Garfield are you? The Electro Smash. Got it. Ooh, good smash, flying man. Good second smash. Hit me! Thank you. It would be awesome if somehow Flying Man existed until the very end. I've never had that happen. I was about to say, oh, that one's a real present, and then I saw that one, but oh. Hello, Electro Swoosh. Yes. I mean, not hitting anyone at all is also fine. I did, like I said, I don't want you to, don't want you to kill my, the flying man, because quite frankly, it is kind of concerning that my courage is so easily felled. Magic can't bat. Hell yeah, who needs an ultimate bat when I got a bat made out of brain magic? Let's just go ahead and toss that. Hi, all of you. Okay, you're not all coming for me. Mr. Molecule and his cohort, Mr. Molecule. Or in a, uh, another sense, Particle Man. And Particle Man does whatever the particle can. Which isn't much. Explains why there's so heckin' many of them. Not green. That doesn't matter. They're like a, f a fobby and an antoid and a baby. Good smash. They're not nearly as endearing as a fobby. Hmm. 
Mushroom Mish. <gasps> Level 43, and by 40 I mean 70, and by 3 I mean 30. Yeah, I dare you to fight me, Electro Swoosh. Oh god, it's French Kiss Death. Hello. Flying man cannot be poisoned. Good job, flying man. Okay, good. Okay, good. Okay, good. Okay, good. We okay, defeated the electro switch again. I feel like I might just be normally go through this game incredibly underleveled. A magic heart. Okay, well. I ate it. I got 5 PP. Because I recall my magic ant adventure is being much more scary. Because anyway, like right now, all, all I, honestly, all I am scared of at, at all is flying man dying. <gasps> okay, that's good. Butterfly. No, but butterfly. Oh, no, that's three Mr. Molecules. Up oh, two Mr. Molecules and a carefree bomb. You are the concerning. They can explode in bad news. They're a danger. They're a danger to all of society. Butterfly. I don't know. I don't think we even need it right now, but butterfly. Hi, Carefree Bomb, Mr. Molecule, or Kiss of Death? Carefree Bombs. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. No, Flying Man, stop getting hit. No, my courage. I should flee. I mean, this, this is pretty painful. Jeez, they're just getting stronger, aren't they? And they're dodging. Okay, you're getting to be a, a bitch, so, um... Life up, Gamma. Flash. There you go. Stop being a bitch. I said stop. There we go. Shame you for... I guess the carefree bomb is what I remember. <laughs> it's probably what I'm thinking of when I'm like, this place is a danger to society and myself and my health and all that good stuff. How'd you guys get up here? I was trying to despawn all of you. I'm just spawning more. Well, this one's chasing me, so I can't really stop it. Good, Mr. Molecule. Hmm, do it. Okay, you know, whatever this setup is, it's probably handleable. <sighs> Ow. Okay. Ow! You and your fucking super bomb? Alright, let's see what we're looking at. We're looking at we don't actually have healing. Ah! Alright. We should just run. We should just run. Yeah, yeah, that probably sounds a good idea. Oh, 
You're supposed to say and did. Oh god. Yes, yes, continue to kill me. Now let me flee. Thank you. Fucking bombs. Care for you or otherwise. Oh, I got a surprise opening the attack. I should have used it to run. Oh, well. uh, I'm sure before we reach the end, we'll find plenty of butterflies. Touch the noodle. Welcome to the aquatic portion of the Sea of Eden, i.e. the actual Sea of Eden. It's smushy. Oh, hi! It's a kraken. I'm a big old dragon now. Big old damage gun. Hit me, you bitch! Not with that. Yeah, the Krakens are generally why I was keeping all those Dragonite bags on me. Because there's more than that one. It apparently was a traumatic enough experience that it, it sticks in my mind. Or something, I guess. There's another one. I might just avoid that one, but I also I don't know if there's like treasures somewhere or anything. That feels like... More... I thought there were only three specifically, but maybe there are more. I have a bag of dragon meat. Ow. That's right, hit my friend from bad, you bitch. It won't work. I have the opinion. Level 75. That was the power of PSI. Uh, 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 Omega. Nope, that is a dead end. You know what, Third Kraken? I think we're just gonna go ahead and fight you. I saw a statue. And quite frankly, you're not actually dangerous, because I got the correct thing to die. So I should have saved the others as well, but oh well. I do like that that's like a, a really strong showing of uh, being heckin' so much more powerful than when you started, or when you where you were not too long ago, even. Because, like, the Kraken, when you first fight it, is a relatively, you know, aside of me doing the thing that worked, lol, is a relatively difficult fight for, like, four characters. And here we are, just, you know, beating down on it with, uh, as just, a uh, good old Damie. Alright. I'm the evil part of your brain. You can't beat me, because you're the one who forced me into being. Oh no. Excuse me. Damie's Nightmare Attack. PSI. Alpha. <laughs> Absolutely not. I could shield, but what's the point? I could paralyze, but what's the point? I could flash. I could BSI Omega, but that costs like a bajillion PP, don't it? Oh yeah, I can't even do that. That costs 98 PP. Jesus Christ. Alright, let's just fight the Oscar. Oh god. Why are you allowed to do that? Ow. 
Like, that's just rude. I'm just gonna hurt myself. Ow. Yeah, your glorious light does nothing. Ow. Deactivate. Damn it, three hits. Don't life up, baby, you bitch. Nope, that's a different... No, that was me. I was hoping that you'd get that off before I did. That's why I got confused. Usually... Oh, God. You're usually faster than me. Case in point. Uh, he, he always attacks on the same... He attacks on the same side all the time. He does alpha, and he does that. It's a, uh, I guess not technically the entire cycle, the same cycle. Yeah. 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 I can probably survive that right too. Especially when it stops moving right there. So we defeated our evil side by beating it into submission. Good. Level 76. Oh, baby. Offense. Oh, baby vitality. Oh, baby sweet. Oh, wow, 40 HP. Dami heard a familiar voice at the center of the Sea of Eden. And I'm sorry, Maven, that it will no longer be able to whisper the sweet nothings in your ear. Gygus's goal is to destroy you. Listen carefully. Everything in the universe could be destroyed at the hands of Gygus. But he and his followers are also in trouble. The Apple of Enlightenment has foretold that Gygus's attempt will fall, fail. It is because of the existence of a boy named Dami. That's me. Listen, free your mind and know what you must do. Your destiny has already been decided by an apple. You, I, where should we go? You know deep within the reaches of your mind. S Sat Saturn. Mm. Saturn Valley, yes. Go to the valley where the Mr. Saturn live. You'll get something new there. Soon Magic Ant will be no more. We must be quick. Dami really heard his own voice. Go to Saturn Valley. Go to Saturn Valley now. Dami was filled with the power of Giant Step. His speed increased by five. His vitality increased by five. He was filled with the power of Lilliput Step. His guts increased by five. His luck increased by five. Dami was filled with the power of the Milky Well. Dami's speed was increased by five. His IQ by five. Dami was filled with the power of the magic, magic, magnet hill. He doesn't know how it works, but Dami's vitality increased by five, and his luck increased by five. He was filled with the power of the rainy circle. His guts increased by five. His IQ increased by five. He was filled by the power of pink cloud. His speed increased by five. His guts increased by five. Dami was filled with the power of the lumen hole. And his luck increased by five. His IQ increased by five. Damien was filled with the power of the fire spring. Then his speed increased by five. Then his luck increased by five. Instantly, Damien's mind cleared, and he realized he had possessed a great power. At that moment, Damien's psychic powers radically expanded. Damien gained uh, you know, 200,000 experience. He's now level 77. So oh, sweet. That's a lot of HP. And a D. Oh, God, look at all that PP. We will never want for PP again. And finally, he realized he had the power to teleport Beta. He no longer has to feel jealous of Pooh for having the ability to teleport in a way that, uh. Yeah, he, he didn't. Normally, I get more level ups than that, which just goes to show I, I definitely have a. Definitely am far higher level than I used to usually am through here. Dami made all of the hi the hidden powers his own. Dami absorbed the power of the land into his heart, and Magicant was no more. 
he ate them. Now you can wake up. Your friends are waiting for you. They were destroyed by a soul-consuming flame. It is time to get up. Ah, oh god, where am I though? My poor, poor brain. Ah, I'm dizzy. Everything is terrible. The soundstone that Danny used to have is gone now. <gasps> what happened, Danny? You've been unconscious for a long time. Y you get to heck and saying something? Saturn Valley. What's waiting for us there? Anyway, we need to teleport. The tightest teleport circle you'll ever see. This is from Teleport Beta. I don't want to be here. Anyway, welcome to Magic Ant. It is the Magic Ant. The place where magic can't, magic can't, magic can't. Magic can't, magic can't, magic can't, magic can't. It's not magic can't, Saturn Valley. I'm an idiot. Where my, I don't know where my brain is. I'm sorry. I was looking at inventory and contemplating. Like, what, what do, I, do I have enough room to take things out? I think I do. Uh, look, them. Let's ignore them for a moment. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba 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 -da <laughs> Hello. No problem here. Alright, it's Gotta Go Express. I want a delivery. No, I don't want a town map. Start over. I want a bicycle. Yes. No, I don't want a Magnum air gun. I, I keep messing that up. Okay, what I want... Ooh, a I want a bag of Dragonite. An Earth Pendant. And a bicycle. Bum, bum, ba, da, da, bum. Was there always three Saturns in that place? Yay! Yes, I can pay for it. I need to call them two more times. Only one of those calls really actually matters, probably. Can we got Yeah, we got inventory space, generally speaking. Okay, yes, hello, Mother. I didn't mean to call you yet, but close enough. Good enough. There we go. Oh, crap. I want... I want the Earth Bandit. Anything else? A couple of life noodles just in case. No, I, don't want, I don't want the jar of fly honey. You know, it's fine. I'll just. Right, now we have at least two items to actually make you drop off, so that'll be fine. I might drop off and may pick up. <laughs> Hello, give me my things. One for Danny. One for Sephra. Equip. 
twit. What, what, what? Ooh, I'm selling. I would like you to purchase from me a diamond man. Yes. I, I don't want to buy anything. I want to sell something. Yes. Sell. Bah, bah. The rain pendant. Yes. Sell. Flame pendant. <laughs> Hey, you can buy and you can sell too. I was decided to do one for you. Oh, yeah, see, now there's a new person. Selling them pendants if you didn't get the earth pendant. Also, piggy jellies for some reason. And what do you sell? The equipment? Yeah. Hello, Father. Didn't mean to call you yet, but as always, whatever. Let's go express. Pick up. Mr. Seven, please get out of the way. Thank you. I would like you to pause it. One. Seven, two, three, eight. There we go. And now we just have to... Yes, I can. Okay, take from me... The eraser, eraser. Baddest beam. Uh. Ah, the Darth Lanny, right? Hey, let's get this crap out of my inventory. Alrighty, we have no money. And, uh, yeah. Let's go talk to the people now. Thank you. I'm not sure what it will happen, but I sense big time trouble ahead for you. I'm gonna stay here for a while and help Mr. Saturn. It's important for a man to enjoy doing his duty. Alright, why'd you build Doug funny? Zoom! Excellent, excellent. Everything's proceeding as planned. Dr. Andernuts, Mr. Saturn, and I worked together and finally completed the Phage Destroyer. The purpose of this device is to enable instantaneous travel through time, space and time. It's a TARDIS. Uh, in this prototype, you can only travel to different points within the same time period. It is able, however, to search uh, out the locations of enemies. Right now, it's indicating the presence of enemies in the Lost Underworld. Yeah, the Mr. Saturn's are incredible, folk. And the Apple Kid, he's a most exceptional young man. Very different from other kids. Well, anyway, uh, the prototype face assault has been stolen. Someone resembling a pig wearing clothes took Mr. Saturn captive and stole the rice. Oh no. <laughs> oh, it doesn't work. One thing is missing. That one material is not normally found on Earth. The material I'm thinking of came from a meteorite that fell when I was much younger. Have you seen a meteorite anywhere recently? No. So we are just going to wait for a meteorite to suddenly fall from the sky? Hmm, you haven't seen a meteorite? Hmm, think for a minute. Have you seen a meteorite anywhere recently? No. That was like weeks ago. Fine. Oh, Eureka! Oh, that's it! With even just a piece of that meteorite, I can synthesize the material Xenox. Zezonite. Zezonite. Yeah, whatever. 
I doubt uh, that your mortal enemy, Gygus, uh, or whatever, uh, will allow you to go to Onet and get the piece of meteorite. But by now, Onet is in his evil hands. You must go, though, uh, so take every precaution possible. Mr. Sadness have introduced some of their uh, new developments in the shop. Please check them out before you leave. I wonder what Onet is like at this point in time. I refuse. Because I can do things that you don't think I can do. Join it. Ow. Alright, we'll do this the, the dumb way. I really should be the one to do it, I guess. I have so much PP. What with being the chosen one. <laughs> Here, oh, and it's uh, in the in the clutches of the evil Gagas now, for some reason. I guess because he's doing things. It's a mechanical octobot and his cohort, the Evil Eye. They can diamondize. I should buy a big bottle, multi bottle rifle or something. <laughs> That's funny, that won't work. Never mind. It worked partially. I mean, you probably shouldn't do anything. Now level 68. Oh baby. Oh baby. Oh baby. <laughs> that rocks. Oh no. The ghost of Starman. Oh god, that's a star story. Ow. Okay, uh, Danny, Omega, Sephira, Nothing, Neutralizer, and, uh, Rain Shock. Now that we uh, are pretty dang certain uh, that he has no psychic shield, let's see what the uh, Omega actually looked like. Why not? PSI! Omega. Damien leveled up. Okay. That rocks. Damien leveled up. Good job, Danny. Alright, let's go take a, a bun bun nap or something. Okay, or we have to fight these because I. Why though? Why, why both of you? Zephyr might die. Zephyr's probably gonna die. Zephyr died. 
It's so close. Alright, dash. Bazook. Who? Get Zephyr up. Three. It doesn't matter. You died. Who leveled up? Just gotta get to mother. No, don't join. Okay, good. I can't block a bot. They don't have an opening move, that's fucking PSI Starstorm. They just fire laser. The Ghost of Starman does have a 1 in 128 chance to uh, drop the most powerful ribbon, though. All right. Up we go. Oh god, so many enemies. Mother, you're here, right? We have Bun Bun, right? Oh, Damie, you finally showed up. There are plenty of creepy monsters running around our net now. The townspeople are barricaded in their homes, afraid to go out. I'm fine, but I am a bit scared. Everything will be okay if we just sit here quietly in the dark. Are you hungry? Do you want to eat some Bun Bun? Yes. Are you more relaxed? Okay. I did want you guys might just, just might be the strongest force in the world. Don't you think? I mean, probably. Father! Save my game. Here. Beep, 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 beep. Oh boy, there's a lot of you. There's a lot of you. Oh good, one of each. Why, why not? Super Thunder. Ah, he does not have a power shield. Good to know. I don't have any any kind of shielding. You just got fucking star storm. Like a bitch. You piece of time wasting shit. How did how did the evil eye not have a turn yet? Boy, Danny's gonna be dead too. You know what? Let's just, let's just go away. Let's just leave. Ow. I was diamondized. Cool. We successfully ran. Back inside. Okay, Pooh. Um. Let's bring me back. Me. Let's bring Danny back. And me, just because it's right there in the front. Bring Sephir back. Hi, Mom. Yeah, let me. I'd like some Bun Bun again. I mean, not really. There are so many enemies outside. So many fucking enemies. Oh boy, you despawn yourself. Uh, you despawn yourself. Okay, but you're a solo fight. You didn't want to. You didn't want to have friends. That's good. Good smash. We're done. Moving on, moving on, moving on. Oh god, again? More? more?
Surprise opening attack. We did it. Hi. I, I see your friend trying to get here. He ain't here in time. Stuck on trees. I don't like the evil eyes feet. Yep, such as diamond. Back. I can't believe you stole a bottle of water from us, you piece of shit. What are we going to hydrate with? Nice. Zephyr's not allowed to level up again. There's a boss right here or not. You know, just in case I saw one of them hanging out right here. Poo. Consume the caramel. Mm -hmm. There's something shiny that you can reach. Do you want to try and get it? Okay. You did it. Oh, that was it. Okay. Well, in that case. Let's get the fuck out of here! <laughs> I just, well, made to drink your own piece. I mean, yeah, we don't have money though. Oh, well, we don't need those multi-bottle rockets anyway. Alright, to Saturn Valley. Yeah. Attack the monkey! Step one. Speak to Saturn. Step two. Call mother. I'm so glad you can still do your dance aerobics while the, there's an alien invasion going on in town. Father! Look at all that money in our bank. If only. Alrighty, and off we go. Hey, I've got the thing. Ah, yes! Oh, this is fantastic! What? Well, I've never actually seen this incredibly rare element before. Oh, it's very intriguing. All right, leave everything to us and you get some rest. This is getting most fascinating. Hi. Hi, Apple Kid. The phase disorder will certainly be completed someday. 
in my hum humble opinion. Zoom! Uh, I'm not gonna say anything new. I'm just gonna do the same thing before. I'm gonna, you're gonna. If you're rapidly cooking the button, rubbing the tension, you're gonna go through the attack again. And so we take a nap, as requested. Not really requested, but prompted. Is it done? Oh, finally, it's complete! The Phase Disorder version 2 is equipped with two new features. Uh, first, it can repair your biological functions. Uh, second, it can save your progress. Uh, don't be afraid, get right in. There's just one thing, though. You might not be able to return, so make sure you're optimally outfitted. Are you ready to go? Yeah, sure. Uh, even if you're not 100% perfectly completely ready, well, you should be as prepared as possible. It would be for the best. Without careful preparation, you would be in big trouble. I just want to make sure you're ready. Let me know when your preparations are complete. We're done. Oh, good, at last. Oh, the time has come. Are you ready? Yes. Remember, the face disorder in version 2 is equipped with two new features. Yes, I you told me these things. Uh, don't be afraid, get right in. Oh. Hey, look, it worked. Sorry, I wanted to blow my nose. Welcome to this place that we heard the music of before. The most beautiful music ever. The best loop ever. Really? Because the old man shows up or because of the black background? Uh, greetings! So you're finally here! Thank you for the heal. Oh, excellent. You're truly excellent. There's only a little time left. I'll give you the last power. Oh, oh no. <laughs> I must go now. Who became conscious of PSI Starstorm Omega? We did it. Kidnapped. I was boing. Kidnapper. Bad guy. Bad guy gone. Zoom. Way too past. Ding ding. Danny checked the broken face distorter. It was a horn of life. Damien got the Horn of Life. It was probably Damien who checked it, not Damien. Hey, look, it's the cave we've been in. No problem here, though. Well, I guess we gotta go to the past. Oh, God. Oh, the phase distorter has been complete. Uh, we could finish it quickly because of Mr. Saturn's incredible scientific skill. The guy gets us attacking from our exact location, but he's attacking from many years in the past. It's very hard for me to tell you, but... Be here to... Boing! Kidnapped, I was boing, kidnapper, bad guy gone to the past. Back to the past. Samurai Jack, boing, zoom. Uh, you, you must warp to the past and fight, but... Well, whatever, I'll just take your face distorter. What's wrong? In order to defeat Gygus, who is attacking from the past, you must warp to the past. This can be done by way of the Phase Distorter 3. Uh, but the machine cannot warp living things. I mean, life forms. Life is demolished in the process of warping. It is the exact opposite of, uh, Terminator. The only way to accomplish the time travel is to transfer your brain program into a robot and send the robot to the past. The transfer means that your spirit will go with the robot while your body is left behind. I cannot promise that your spirit will come back after the battle in the past. Yet you must understand that the four of you are the chosen ones. Do you still wish to face Gygus by traveling to the past? I mean, sure, I guess, yeah. Do you want to fight the villain who will destroy and conquer the world slash universe? 
or do you want to you know keep your body and not risk being destroyed utterly to destroy the enemy? Um, you accept this well knowing that you may not be able to return to your current form, right? Oh god, I hadn't considered that. Yeah, sure. Yes, I see. You really have your mind. You really have set the. You have really set your mind on this. Let me take a good look at you now, Damy. You're like the sun I never had. Give me your hat. Ready. Uh, stand by. Clonk. I always hated this part myself. Just having like... It's like the whole point is like, oh yeah, we're going to download your brain, like you know, your quote-unquote brain program, the essence of you. You know, your thought patterns and everything. By which I mean we're going to drill into your head. Sephira! Pooh! I'm sorry. Danny didn't make it. It's up to you three. Uh, Danny, though. Uh, no, uh, sorry, uh, that was a uh, wrong note. Uh, Danny, my son. There's no turning back now. Danny activates the phase to start a three by your own hand. Thereby following your own destiny. Will you do so? No. I see. Danny, you do it! <laughs> nah, heck no. Oh, you lost your nerve. Damie, it's up to you then. No, I see. Danny! Do it! Okay. Only a few people know of your amazing courage, Danny. But the number of people you've saved through this bravery is immense. Uh, actually, my, my courage died. I watched it die a horrible, bloody death. I held it in my arms as I watched the life leave its eyes. I wept. That's why Danny had to push the button. And yes, it was absolutely... A, they probably got a dentist drill or something. I feel very fortunate to be present at the beginning of this monumental undertaking. Phase distorting waves... Can't believe we're going back to the past. Oh my god. I have a hat. And no one else was allowed to have any kind of identifying character power, characteristic or anything. It is creepy as fuck. Yeah, it's an enemy. I suppose I should save the game. Repair me. Ah, Danny, it's your dad. Who is this? Danny, got a cold or something? The boy sounds kind of funny. Ah, well, that's okay. Well, experience the next level. Get a mount. Save the game. You better hope that you don't, like, fucking softlock yourself by doing it right here like this. Anyway, we should be fine. Like, they could have at least given us a more attractive robot design, you know? Oh god, they, they spawned another one. What are you? Ah, the wild and woolly shambler? And I think that's a marauding Octobot. Sorry, ultimate Octobot. How fucking dare you try to steal from me, you piece of absolute garbage. What if they get the bread roll? Shouldn't work on anyone, except for maybe Pooh. I have a feeling. Your equipment sucks, Pooh. 
Okay, I'll have to knock the bot destroyed. Everyone's missing. It just disappeared. We didn't defeat it. We didn't scrap it. We didn't destroy it at all. It just disappeared. Okay, let's get going. Maybe actually get a little further or not. Uh, okay. Or we can miss a bunch of again. I'm concerned by what that mysterious electrical field might do. Turnish crap. Good smash. I leveled up. That rocks even more PP. Okay, but at least give me a green. Oh good, a nuclear reactor bot and the ghost of Starman. That thing's going to explode, isn't it? Fuck the star from off the top. That's right, destroy the blue. Okay. Okay. Good. Everything, everything's fine. Outside of the fact that you are nuclear and probably going to have a meltdown from the video. It's fine. We're robots. Kaboom! Solidify. Dying like that is also perfectly fine. So in the bag attack. Yeah, you know, quite frankly, no. Oh god. That's bullshit game. Well, in that case, let's just leave. Now they have the fresh body of Sephir to, to devour and everything, and that's fine. Get up, Sephir. Thank you. 
Well, we despawned one of them. A squatter demon. Oh god, that's a painful smash on Danny. We should, we should be able to destroy the squatter demon before, uh... From. You are good. That's exactly what I was thinking your opening attack was probably gonna be. Oh god, we can't get away. He's replenishing his fuel. Give me this. A legendary bat. In lieu of anything else? He's at least got that for Damien. Yay. Oh, Sephiroth leveled up. Now we need to... Ooh, baby. Uh, I feel like we should... Orb. Oh. Yeah, I almost feel like we should you know, let Danny level up one more time then. You know what? It's fine. He has the perfect IQ. What's that behind me? Be a replenishing robot. Nope, that's the worst. Killed the ghost again. I don't know why it won't stay dead, but I'll get there eventually, I guess. Orb. Oh. Robot? Nope, that's a final star, man. Brain shock on the wall. Didn't work, didn't work, didn't work, didn't work. You know what? Okay, you know what? We're fine then. Attack! Attack! Don't dodge! Why do you have stars coming off of two? It's rude. Steph was gonna die because he did a stupid bomb attack. And we healed the enemy instead. Uh, bullshit! I might as well use the Horn of Life then, because at least that's someone else carrying it. I'll use this horn of life. Get up, Sephra. for Danny. What are people at? We're still missing 50. We're missing 20. Nobody cares and you're also full. Okay, Danny also consumed the tart. I think we got a candle in there too somewhere. There we go, yeah. You know what? 
What the heck and whatever. Sefa, recover 20. Alright, in we go. Welcome to the pulsating mass. Not sure where Jimmy is, but I'm sure we'll find him soon. Ah, there he is. Hello, Jimmy. Sure, that's just an eyeball where Pokey used to supposedly have a mouth. <laughs> Jamie, are you surprised? It's me, Harky. I exist, assist only the strong and able. That's Pokey. You guys look pathetic. The Apple of Enlightenment has already made a prediction. But I won't let what the Apple of Enlightenment predicted take place. You guys will be beaten by Gygus. Gygus will be stronger and more powerful entity and more and a Gygus will be stronger, karma, a more powerful entity than any other. Why? Oh, cause of me. I was led by Gygus and now I'm here. The Apple of Enlightenment couldn't predict this. Master Gygus. No. Gygus is no longer the wielder of evil. He has become the embodiment of evil itself, which he cannot control on his own. He is the evil power. He has your face. Oh god! Gygus and its cohort attack. Fuck you, heavily armed pokey. Like when he has a shield. Neutralizer. PSI. Alpha. This song is awesome. I think it's not yet, possibly. Depending on the dialogue you're recalling. Oh, look at that, you attempted the same thing. Cool. Well, in that case... I should be a side flash omega. No, I don't think that'll actually help us in this case. Um, um, um. You know, I should bash Gagas. Sephra. And suddenly it rock. Okay, they're in different rows. Freeze Omega Gagas. Damn. Bazook. Who? Heal Sephra. PSI! Beta, I should probably set up a fucking psychic power shield. Oh god, Danny. Okay. I have clearly forgotten things about this fight. I guess we're supposed to be fighting, uh... We are supposed to be, um, fighting Pokey. I need that offense. Okay, we're healing up slowly but surely. Um, let's just go ahead and do that again. Sephra. Power shield for everyone who get Danny back in on this. Wanted the shield before that. It's good thing we uh, Omega it again. Okay. 
Can you heal yourself up a little bit more, Sephira? Take the risk of hitting Pokey. Pokey. And back of Dragonite. Damn it! Okay, so I, I just want the... Boy, I'm learning so many things about this fight that I never knew. Slash, never remembered. Okay, Danny, once again, do the thing. Sephira. And I guess offense up on us. Maybe the Zook. He does quickly again. Okay, just dissipate that shield. Cause I probably could. I, I just for not knowing slash or calling if if I would have just strengthened that by casting the other shield or whatever. Yeah, fair enough. I understand you guys are already claiming to be heroes. Well, it is a gazillion years too early for you to repurse Gygus. You must feel pretty stupid to keep fighting without even knowing what Gygus looks like. If you were ever to see... If you were to ever see Gygus, you would be so petrified with fear. You'd never be able to run away. That's how scary it is. So, do you want me to turn off the Devil's Machine? Or prepare to be amazed. Isn't this terrifying? I'm terrified too. Gygus cannot think rationally anymore. And he isn't even aware of what he's doing now. His own mind was destroyed by his incredible power. What an almighty idiot. Yep, that's what he is. <laughs> and you, you will be just another meal to him. Hi, Gygus. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, life up again. Chef, if you wouldn't mind uh, shielding everyone psychically. Pew pew. And bash. He dodged quickly. Dee. You cannot grasp the true form of his attack, but it seems that he tried to cast Flash. Good job. Freeze. Heavy bazook. Stop crying. Damn He did the thing again. Oh. Noted. I shouldn't bring Pooh back yet. Do it. Consume. Oh, 
I should mirror and become Gaius. <laughs> you must really be a handy herb. In this bizarre dimension, you're far the only farce fighting for justice. And here you stand, waiting to be burned up with the rest of the garbage in this universe. Ha ha ha, it's so sad. I can't help but shed a tear. I mean, if I had eyes. You know, my heart is beating incredibly fast. I must be experiencing absolute terror or a heart attack. Do you want to scream for help here in the dark? <laughs> Why don't you call for mommy, daddy me? Say, mommy, daddy. I'm so frightened. I think I'm going to wet my pants. I know you have telepathy or something, so just try and call for help. You pathetically weak so heroes of so-called justice. No one will help you now. Ha 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 ha! Don't worry. Your pitiful suffering will be over soon. Hi, Gaius. He gave us a hint. We should probably listen to it. Please, give us strength, if it is possible. Please, somebody help us. Clank, where? All of the Mr. Saturns felt a new, startling feeling they had never experienced before. And they all started praying for the safety of Damie and his friends. I mean, that should be enough to defeat Gygus, right? The power of Mr. Saturns? These defenses became unstable! Now use this one. The one people see a fetus in. Dammy, 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 Friends. Friends. Ow. 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 prayed from the bottom of her heart. Please. Give us strength. Hello. Anyone who can hear our plea, help us. I see you heard the plea and came to join. Suddenly, one of the runaway five felt something stop him, and he prayed fervently for the safety of Damie and his friends. It looks to be for you, it looks for you like a lamb. Um, yeah, when I don't quite see myself. I can see where people claim, like, oh my gosh, I see a fetus there. Or like a baby or something. Oh. But yeah, I mostly just, I do also mostly just see, like, I, I can see that. Like, I can see why people would say that, but... Like, that wasn't the intent, supposedly, of anything at all, ever. And mostly you just see the horrifying evil faces. Anyway, I should probably, uh, wipe up Omega just in case. Pray! Use the bazooka again. Please, give us strength! Speed this prayer to all the people of Earth! We need a spirit bomb. Huh. It looks 
east on the left. Sefer's father thought he somehow heard his daughter's voice and prayed sincerely for the safety of Sephra and her friends. It hurts. It hurts. Yeah, that'll learn you. Yeah, that means he's got long ears and is looking to the left. No, I am unfortunately still not seeing it. I don't doubt that you're seeing what you're seeing. I just, I, I can't see it. It does not help that the thing is continually rippling. I'll maybe look for it again uh, a bit later, like with a screen cap or something. Oh. We don't need to heal yet. Pray. Bazook, because why not? Good job, Pooh. Davey. I'm so sad. Davey, 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 Davey. Ow. Oh no. Ow. Oh no. Ow. Ow. Oh, that's a waste of a non prayer. Nope, not that. Pray! I feel good. Damey, 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 damey. Ah. Ooh. Oh god, thunder. Guy just doesn't like that, uh... What's his name do the thing? Please give us strength. Anyone who can hear our plea, help us. I don't have a Discord thing set up. Like, in terms of, I don't got no bot for that, nor do I have a Discord group. <laughs> Suddenly, Tony felt anxious about Danny, comma, and he prayed strongly for the st safety, not the strength, the safety of Danny and his friends. Ah, you're starting to take damage, Guigu. Please, grant us power. Anyone who can hear our plea, help us. All of the girls who wanted to boink poo came together and prayed. A young woman in Dalam woke from a dream in which Prince Pooh died, and she began to pray for the well-being of Pooh and his friends. Haha! I'm happy, Danny. Go back. Ow. Ha ha! Franklin badge, bitch. Danny, it hurts. It hurts. It hurts, Danny. Damn it, stop solidifying Sephra's body. Please, grant us strength. Anyone who can hear our plea, we ask for this. Who's left? 
Ah, yes. The lady from the fast food store. I mean, Frank. Suddenly, Frank recalled Damie's shining young face and began to pray diligently for the safety of Damie and his friends. Zephyr seems to be running out of options. It hurts, Damie. Ah, ah, I'm happy. Didn't work, didn't work. Are you just gonna die, Pooh? It didn't work, yay. Yep, everyone healed up, why not? Smack it. Yeah, it's good. Just smack it on. Please grant us power. Speak this prayer to all the people of Earth, the Earth. Oh, I was I was gonna make a joke about it being the exit mouse. One. What the fuck was the dog doing outside? Two. How did it open the door? Suddenly, Damie's mother felt terribly uneasy, and she began to pray for the safety of her son and his friends. Four digit damage. Uh, I feel good. I'm so sad, Damie. It hurts. It hurts. Oh, damn it! Stop solidifying the bodies. Yeah, you deserve that smash, bitch. Uh, yeah, keep on top of healing everyone just because we can. I'm gonna spy on Damie. It's not right. Not right. Not right. I feel good. Ow. Ow. Yeah, Pooh probably deserves that. Are they able to move? Yikes, his offense is 255. Oh, susceptible to brain shock. I guess that's a little strange. Ugh. Ugh. Damn it, 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 Give us your strength. Did it confuse you because, you know, Sephiroth, Sephir and her friends' calls touched the heart of Am. Because Doom prayed for the kids, having never met them before. Em and Emmy kept praying. Damien's game <laughs> kept praying. <laughs> but yes, you see right here, here, the chat has the accent. The chat room felt they, they needed help and prayed for the Damien's Gamian pet kept praying. <laughs> <laughs> we did it, everyone. We used the power of God and anime to help save the day across the meta space of the fourth wall. 
see me. Now I... Well, it's gonna seem like I'm running away. Perhaps I'll just sneak away to another era to think about my next plan. It's a good bet that we will see each other again. Alright, be seeing you. Hi, you can sit. Summer, 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 you cool guy. <laughs> yeah, I agree. Especially because when I played through this the first time, uh, and then he never saw this again. True. Especially because when I was playing through this the first time, obviously I just put in my name, and I'm just like, this is really dumb. Why are they asking you for your name? I don't, I don't like this. Uh, and then they turn it around to that, and I'm like, oh, actually this, this, this stabbed me in the heart. Oh no. It got me right in the feels. Boom. <laughs> we broke the game though. Mother. The war against Gygus is over. See, we can heal, you know, the mind with our PSI, but you can't fix a mechanical body. As the souls drift away. saved and the future is secure. Damn it, Pooh, what are you doing? You've ruined everything, how dare you? What's weird is we have our hat. Because the head on that robot was our hat. But now this is our hat. <laughs> I get all caught up in my cable here. I don't know who's saying this. I'm gonna assume Pooh. Our travels together end here. I must return to Delam and use this experience for the good of my country. Dami, Sephra, Danny. Let me demonstrate a strange power before I go. I realized this power as a child. This is true. PSI, farewell! Now! I'll see... No, excuse me. I'll see you again someday. Spawn presence. <laughs> the power making a goodbye. Awkward. <laughs> uh, Sephra, Damy, easy yours was cutting. Didn't go through the other plastic one. <laughs> uh, it was heckin' great to ha hang out with you guys. It, I mean, it, it really, really was. Like, like, trust me, I'm, I'm not trying to flee as soon as possible to go back to the comfort of like being alone and stuff. It's just. I mean, I am doing that, but it, it, it was still pretty heckin' great to hang out with you guys. Uh, I'm, I'm glad I had the chance to, like, use some of the theories that uh, I've been studying so hard. It, it's remarkable. <coughs> if, uh, just maybe... Uh, yeah, you two can get hitched someday. Like, maybe I'll be uh, the one that fixes, like, your broken electronic appliances. I, I, I don't know, that's a weird, really, really weird 
goodbye. That's a, that's a really weird hope and dream. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna I can go home and make a bomb. I, I fired enough bottle rockets. I, th I think I can make them myself now. <clears throat> I'm gonna actually stay here for a while so I can see what I learned from uh, Dr. Andonuts. I, I, I mean, uh, from, from my tech and dad. Uh, so if it, uh, it looks like it's goodbye for now, huh, my friends. I, I've been heckin' informed that this Mr. Saturn is uh, my new mom. So, uh, yeah. Damie, will you escort me home? No. Well, then I'll escort you. We did it. And we still even have a cup of life noodles. And the bread roll survived. We did it. <laughs> I've opened the present. There's a letter from Mom inside. Amy takes it. The fuck was Pooh doing with a letter from my mom? There's a letter from Tony inside. Amy takes it. The letter from the kids inside. Zephyr takes it. I like that we got a letter from Tony, but Amy has or Danny has already left the party. So we're just reading we're just reading this mail now. Uh, dear Danny, everything's really going great here. I wish I could have gone with you on your adventure, even just part of the way. But instead, I'm sitting here waiting for you in winters. I want to see you again as soon as possible. I can't wait to see your cheerful face. Well, I bet your glasses are dirty. If you come back, I'll clean them for you. Like I said, I'm waiting for you. Yours truly, Tony. P.S. Don't show this letter to anyone. Ah, uh, hey, Danny. I got a letter for you. It was heckin' fun to hang out together. Okay, well. Uh, you know, you know what? Let's just, uh... <laughs> you shouldn't throw the letter from Tony away. But I wanna! It is actually canonical that Tony is, uh, gay for Danny. Like, super gay for Danny. Uh, letter from the kids. Dear Sephwa, how are you doing? I'm fine. I'm fine too. So are me. Me also. Me okay. Please come and play with us again at the Pole Stop Wee School. Oh yeah, one more thing. Bring us some presents. If you have any. Sincerely, your friends the post op preschool. You know what? We should give those kids something nice. Sephra, when I take you home, give those children this bag of Dragonite. Alright, I got a letter from my mom, too. This is true. You don't. Dear Danny, how are you? Since you left home on your journey, things have changed around here. For example, I don't have as much laundry. Also, we don't seem to eat Bun Bun as much as we used to. I heard that you defeated some universal evil character. What was it? A Googie or something like that? Well, that sounds really great. I want to hear all the details, so hurry home, okay? Tracy, Fenrir, and I are waiting for you. Love, Mama. And yet she did. Ah, incredible! Excellent! I'm not quite sure what for, but uh, congratulations on the job well done. If we ever have the chance to get together again, let's go on a picnic or something. Maybe we can play horseshoes, too. You're like 45. A chance of Gygus gaining victory with his monstrous plan is 99%. However, your courage has produced a 1% chance that Gygus fails. I must try to uh, come to a deeper understanding of this trait called courage. Well, courage is like a man that can fly. 
who dies. <laughs> My water cup is empty. I must cons pour water to consume water. obtained. Okay. Mouse, it was in Winters that we last met. I just got here. TTT. Was scared. Now kill. I strong. Boing. Zoom. Oh, oh, wheeze. Breathe is so good. So it's so good. Breathe. Boing. Zoom. Happy ding ding, much more happy boo boos. Big big happy zoom. I think new things, difficult things from now. I think that Mr. Saturn is going to appear ready. I wish fall in love, that one too. So boing, you have three eighty dollars. We trade secret herb. So boing, you have one seven eighty dollars. We trade horn of life. Make new thing. Must make daddy. Ugh. What? No. Boing. Yurika ding. Healthful. Appreciate. I so happy, happy, happy. Zoom. Dakota. Drink coffee before the go. Say yes to me. Say no to me. No. Why you say no? Would I be put through that whole cutscene again from way back when if I say yes? We're gonna find out. Bottoms up, bing. Oh, thank God. Bell rings, ding ding, boing. Sweet, fresh feel. But yeah, so now we can totally... I think we can just take... We could, in theory, just use PSI to get back to places. But you can also wander the entire fucking world, pretty much potentially get new dialogue from many, many people. I do what I say. Cross hat. What did you say you are going to do? I'm conflicted about, uh... Just like them or two. Yep. I'm pretty sure all Danny says is what we saw Danny said. Which was, you know, whatever it was, something about the appliances or something. I suppose I can try to use the letter while standing directly in front of him. If I hang out together, that, that's what he says. Ah, uh, Danny, you've uh, read it. Oh, uh, you're hecking read it already. Uh, that Tony has a heckin' heart of gold. Okay, then. It's a miracle. A miracle that only happened because of your great courage. Believe me, I went through a lifetime worth of stress while you were gone. I just wish I could come with you as a robot. I should have used the face distorter. What a story that would have been. Scientist and four kids save the world! <laughs> I 
Anyway, we can. I am vaguely conflicted. Because on the one hand, we could not take Sephra home. And uh, that's a thing we can indeed do. And I've never technically seen whatever extra dialogue she has at that point. On the other hand, if we take Sephra home, I get to ride my bicycle. Like, if Sephra weren't here right now, I could ride my bicycle all the time. This whole way. <laughs> I believe technically the home with my the one with my mom. But we could always go visit the lake the one that I bought. You know, the one out by the lake. Like eighty miles or something from Santa Fe. truck is indeed parked there. I put a Mew under it, though, just to be sure. Hey, I heard you got a share of the treasure found in the desert. Didn't seem to change you at all, though. here now. I should ask Hintman what to do next. Excuse me. I thought there was something more to you than your smile. Yes, my smile. The zombies and ghosts are not on the loose anymore. Oh yeah, you guys got rid of the monsters. Whoops. <laughs> We are one because of our brains, guts, and togetherness. Wow, what a rush. Because for all I know, chunks of this may not even, may not be new dialogue whatsoever, and it's just because I didn't go back and talk to them again after frame three. Did I talk to you? It's trying to be dark, but thanks to you, now it's bright. Sure, don't talk about it. What do you want? I want to buy things. <laughs> it has that people my wife and get Yeah, you guys aren't saying anything now. It's not a great many cars. Just started driving through. It's incredibly noisy. I didn't like fighting the zombies, but the, those days were never dull. Actually, I'm kind of glad that I got to see real zombies. I became quite peaceful compared to before. I made our lives peaceful so I can sleep again. You use a bunch of peace humor, right? Ha ha ha. You're the enemy of all zombies, you monster. Just go back to your eternal rest because your heckin' boss is gone. Is it three again? sunny out today. <laughs> but my psychic powers are too strong. I would stop it with the sheer force of my brain. I have lots to get my house so I can't get in. No, no, you don't need to look for it. I'll look for it myself. to the orphanage now the game is over. Oh. 
Wild Orphanage. Hi, smile. Welcome to this far. Take a rest. Long journey must have been. The book overcoming shyness was very helpful to us. We've kept it for a long time, but I'll return it now. Thank you very much. Oh fuck, now I got the shyness book again. We're living in peace now, in a wide variety of lifestyles. Thank you very much. I'm a woman. Did you think I was a man? Hi, how are you today? Are you not feeling healthy? healthy? Oh! No, that is a boarding school. And probably not, but we can give it a shot. But I understand now. Can we still die in the swamp? No, we are immune to dr drowning now. Nope, Tony's just hanging out outside. Danny doesn't call me. Maybe he thinks I'm too annoying. But I don't think so. Danny, did you tell him not to call me? No, I know you wouldn't do that. If you see Danny, please, please ask him to call Tony. Thanks. Ah, Danny just called. Uh, he's with Dr. Ando. That's <laughs> he, called, he called me. Won't call Tony. Uh, the two of them uh, may be able to develop a new scientific theory. You've helped make a beautiful life for everyone. Ah, Danny. My husband has been returning home late these days. He says he's busy. I know he's out saving the earth, but a marriage is also important. He's not doing anything of the sort. He's just hanging out with... <laughs> he's just hanging out and having an affair with a, a monster of a lake. Sorry, the bubblegum sold out. Is it cold outside? No. I need to sell things. Okay, so we do have a book about overcoming shyness, so we do need to go to the library at some point. I suppose we can go down to the uh, Tessie Watchers. Tessie consumed them. A little bit. No, she's just making homicidal noises. Like the awning. I wonder what Tessie thinks of me. Tessie appeared again today and smiled at me. Do you think my name will make me made into the newspaper? I can't believe that I was so brave. I'm so glad I finally saw it. I'm so happy it brings tears to my eyes and makes my nose run. Boo hoo hoo, snort. Boo hoo. I waited for you. I'm glad to see you again. You're back, Sebastian. I just love making haiku. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three. Okay, oh, yeah. I mean, it's not really a haiku, though. I waited for you. I'm glad to see you again. 
It's snowing on Mount Fuji. I'm the cook for the Tetsu Watching Club. How about some stew? No thanks. You're full, aren't you? Yes. In the monkey community, Damy is famous. You're such a great man. I no longer chew bubblegum. At least not for you. Okay, let's try a new place. Scaravia. The Tinder tribe used to live here. They went back to the dark. It's not new. Hi, there, here. Hey. Ah, oh, big yawn. Sorry. People aren't saying new things to me right here. A hint, man. Well, I want to thank you for all the times that you used the hint shop. It's been a while since I first saw you. This is my final day in business. Well, so long, kid. Nope, nope. Master Damien. See you again if fate allows it. I want to go see the dungeon, man. Yes, all those times. I kept his family fed. Totally. It's like I want to go talk to the dungeon man, but I don't have the key, so I probably can't actually climb up his butthole. Taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Said, ready, say, Fuzzy Pickles. Wow, what a great photograph. It will always bring back the fondest of memories. Yeah, I'll see you again soon enough, I'm pretty sure. Dungeon Man. There he is. Did it. <laughs> yeah, I genuinely was thinking I wouldn't be able to, so I'm glad I can. He's probably not going to say anything new, which will make me sad, but it's worth the attempt if he does. Possible. I can't believe he let all his uh, zoo creatures out, though. That went the wrong way.
Ah, no, I was just on the wrong floor. There they are. Excellent. Welcome! I don't know how, but my homemade dungeon helped... I, I don't know how, but my homemade dungeon helped you out, Brickrib. I'm glad. Worth it. Alright, back out the poop chute. Plus he gave me a heal. So, you know, I can teleport again without worry, because I, mean, I, I had big worries, because we were almost out of PP. You returned from exploring the deep darkness. I cannot believe I you made it back alive. Alright, well, let's... Let's see, I get a place to go. Maybe back to the monkeys, I don't really care, though. Let's go ask what the fuck was up with that weird goodbye. Hey, Pooh, what was up with that weird goodbye? You're here! We have little, but stay and rest for a while. Well, I'm impressed. You did so well for one who hasn't had much training. Yeah, it's... Was a bit kind of comes naturally to me, and uh, you're weak. As I thought the prophecy foretold of our only chance for success, please enjoy the life ahead of you as a regular boy. We understand that you've experienced hardship in the past. No one could fight the evil entity except you. We are proud. We are happy. We are not your father. Prince Pooh has returned, so everyone is extremely happy. Please stay and relax. No. I'm a little embarrassed to say it, but I'll tell you anyway. I thought philosophy was the study of stones. I now realize it's about studying all night. What? It's not? Farting. Prince Pooh has good relationships with foreigners. What an international person! Hello. <laughs> yes, I am indeed having my little bits of fun. I've never actually explored fully with it. Probably still not going to actually see everything anyway, because I'm bad at finding all the things, but it's interesting to see. Please come in. Look around the house as much as you want. And then some people say the same thing as before. And it's like, but why? Prince Pooh is so cool, and you're also young and tough. But you're- but- but, not and. But you're also young and tough. I didn't eat any garlic today, so the room doesn't stink. I wonder if Prince Pooh succeeded in moo training. I wanted him to come by and show me his best barnyard impression. Hello. Congratulations. Thank you. Oh, my foreign language still has worked. I'm waiting for Prince Pooh to see me and say I love you. You and I both. I'm gonna heckin' train. Morning. 
<laughs> I am not nearly skilled enough to do that. Alrighty, next up, super. Crash into the lady. Wait, wait, what other? I didn't actually stop moving the button. The sky is blue and the sun is high. The prices here are so high, I make your face turn blue. That's Summers. Ah, uh, yeah. I didn't leave anyone alive to be able to do that. It's hard to get through there without actually killing them. I uh, thank you again, Poke. Ah, uh, Mr. D. Probably gonna want at least one dollar. I wanted to come in here to talk to the people who aren't the workers. Excuse me. You're not, not here. Don't say anything, are you? Forget about the adventure. Come back again. Might have been new. Bum, bum, bum. I can't believe you pronounce hotel as hotel. In this country, hotel is pronounced hotel. What? So then, in your country, is, it, is otter pronounced as otter? How should I know these things? Don't get too excited about this town. It's a terrorist town. Everyone seems to be nice. They're just talking about the exact same stuff that I was talking about before. <laughs> Agreed. <laughs> that would make sense here. Yeah. Especially if your goal is specifically to be able to see it for yourself and you know, do it yourself and whatnot. Oh. Rather than just being like, well, if it happens, it happens, and oh well. Restaurant. I have a feeling no one's going to say anything now. I have the braised bell of a minced baby leeks. Oh, you're not the waiter. Bun bun? Please, we don't serve such trash on this menu. I hate this place. Hey, hey! Stop putting your grandma fingerprints all over my car, you little punk! I can't wait. You're already filming that. You're gonna try something tasty. Have a magic tart. Try it. Thank you for just giving me a magic tart. So much now, though, I have to speak with you. I want to try. Makes sense. This is now a truck stop. Absolutely no miners admitted. Imagine the lazy cowpoke stop and go. You're hey, already going to check out that. I don't want to. It's going to make me pay money, and I don't have the thing. They do need to change their sign. Another nice day. Summer size has sunny days. Sunny days. <laughs> Used to hear the park town of Toto. No, I'm not a billboard. I could be, though, if I wanted. Uh, you're an important person. Compared to the olden days, this boat ride is like being on a luxury liner. If you want another ride, I'll give you a ride if you want, since you destroyed the Kraken. 20 bucks per person is fine with me. No, I understand. Stay here and shiver in fear for your future. Ha 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 Yo, uh, this is a lazy cowpoke stop and go. Yeah, we're the new truck stop we just opened. What was that? Stoic Club. That lame old place shut down ages ago. We totally remodeled the place. Now we got loud music, great food, and really ratty crowds. Listen, buddy, I'm too busy to talk to you right now. Just drop by any time. You come, you enjoy, I promise. Click, beep, 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 beep. 
<laughs> Jeez. Yeah, I don't I don't think I'd have the patience to get to level 12 and do that. I I now want $2. And I'd be tempted to ride the boat again, but then we'd have to watch the boat riding animation. And I don't want to do that. Mark Pizza. Hello, this is Mark Pizza. Our delivery man got tired and quit. So we decided to just close up the shop. Thank you for constantly, consistently using us for all your pizza needs. Click. Hello, this is Escargo Express. Tracy doesn't work here anymore. But yeah, she used to work here part time. Hun, this is Damie, Tracy's big brother. I've heard about the great work you're doing. It's an honor to talk to you, sir. Oh, you're calling for delivery? I'm very sorry. My wife is out on maternity leave, so I'm taking care of my other kid. I decided to take some time off in the delivery business. It's right next to the fridge. Uh, put it in the microwave. That's it. Uh, sorry about that. I'm a little busy right now, as you heard. I really would like to hear some of your stories. Zoiks! That was the dog's food! Crash. Hey, hey, hey! Uh, now look what you've done! I I'm sorry, I've got to go. Goodbye. Click. Yay. Well, we might as well call Mom and Dad, because I'm curious. We could also find a phone that doesn't cost money, but whatever. Hello, Dini. You can finally come home. Oh, so that means... Oh, thank heavens! You did it and you're safe! I'm not exactly sure what you did, but... Anyway, if you come home quick, I'll make some bun-bun. Get here as soon as you can. I can't wait to see your bright and shining face. Click, beep, beep, beep. Hey, it's your dad. Let's get to the next level. Ha 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 I guess I don't need to tell you this anymore. Next week I'll be your birth will be your birthday, Damien. Trying very hard to be home for that big day. So I'll be sure to give you a good present. I'm following your adventures closely. I want to hear about them from you in person. You sound a lot more mature over the phone. Well, I'll see you at home then. Bye. Click the beep beep beep. Fist fist. Okay, well, I guess that's Summers, because I really don't expect anyone here on the beach to say anything different either. Only a tanner pair like me is able to get a suntan on his palms. So yeah, good for you. I'm gonna just kick sand in your face for a little bit while I teleport. Uh, 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 uh. I guess they mean to go to Foreside. You yeah, boys are young, but you did a great job here. But you did a great job here and out there. Thank you. I misjudged you guys. I thought you were little snot-nosed punks. I know better now. Let's go all the way to talk to Monotoli. Hello, baby face. What brings you to the Enriched Flavor Building? Or, or he's right here. Oh, Damien. Sephra. I'm Gildegard Monotoli. Don't you remember me? I returned this building to Mr. Enriched Flavor. Now I'm working as an elevator man. I'm very happy. It's good to be alive. I heard of your many successes. Wonderful. Sounds like your lifestyle isn't something I'd be that proud of. Last night, there was a solitaire tournament. I lost my shirt. I'll invite you next time. Hey, wait, do you even know what solitaire is? I don't think you do, because you somehow lost your shirt. That's what we're about to find out. The elevator goes directly to the 47th floor. All aboard. Just kidding. I guess the just kidding was the all aboard. Thank you for not claiming I'm going to sit here staring at your hips, though. A lot has happened to me. I'll have to try and sort it all out. Thinking is tough on me. It's tough on it. I'll read dry that again. When I'm, okay, I'm gonna ignore you for a moment. Sorry, not him again. A lot has happened to me. I have to try and sort it all out. Thinking is tough for me. When I'm off duty from my bodyguard job. I still have a lot of pent-up energy, 
But don't worry, I won't come after you. Unless you're kind of itching for a fight. I would destroy you, so yes, please. There's no one in here. Likely no one in the other room either. We're gonna check. Bum, bum, bum. Let's go find out who enrich flavor is, if we can. This elevator is on top of the building, the 40th floor. Enjoy your ride, even though it's only one floor. Excellent. I am very curious who enrich flavor is. I was trying to find Electra, but oh well. You have brought the town of Fullside back to life. I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. Yep. <laughs> Just some guy hanging out. Made the attempt. There she is. Thanks for dropping by, even though there's nothing to do here, honey. Forty-seventh floor. <sighs> Pretty sure if we're not actually going to take Sephra to her home. No, don't talk about your hips. Need to make sure we do not cross in front of the preschool. <laughs> Same. You're all getting in better shape every time I see you. Don't you want to be a police officer? Hell no! Very far first at Bakery, you shake a word at Bakery. You're very young, but you brought something very precious back to the people of this town. Thank you. I heard they couldn't find the buried gold. Those guys worked really hard, but they all, they all, got, was, they, all they got was a diamond. Words. I mean, it's, she's become even more beautiful. You gotta make me pay. Thank you. I'll talk to you and, I, and find out why in a bit. I don't know why I'm coming back to see fucking Spoon. 
As I thought, dinosaurs did actually exist in history. Yes, I have surefire proof. I've seen them in so many movies, they must be real. He's just the worst person, isn't he? The Dinosaur Museum doesn't have any real dinosaurs. Oh, replicas. I'm sure everyone knows that. If you still want to go see the dinosaurs, pay $5 a piece for interest fee. Is that okay? No. Well, you let me go in without paying, so I don't care. I suppose we could have potentially gone into the Scarabia Museum as well then, but... If I do this, though, I'm going to have to watch another Venus show just to see if Venus is there, aren't I? I've never heard of a person, anyone who doesn't even have $30. <laughs> oh, excuse me for laughing in your face. Somehow I feel like the lights is blah, 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 mess is six cents. Okay, fine, you know what game? There. Yes, I have thirty dollars, you bitch. see the Runaway 5 if they are back in Tucson, because my backstage pass is inside my uh, bag. The Escargot Express bag. I don't want to watch the show, I just want to talk to Venus. Okay, so far so good. I paid $30 just to talk to her. See you again. Look, I'm busy right now. I'll give you an autograph next time. Are you here to see the sh my show? No. Oh, I see. Looks like you aren't too busy. Make yourself at home for a while. I'm afraid to say yes because that'll make the show happen. That's what. That's my, that is my fear. We don't need to see Venus again. Yeah, you know, I, I probably should just go ahead and try to talk to this lady too while we're here. Okay, don't forget, life is money. I have lived that life. You can buy everything but love, friendship, and experience points. I mean, that's not entirely true these days. Especially the experience points. Mm -hmm. No problem. Hey, dear friend of the one right five, I'm jealous. In the future, you will build cities and even create a country. I'm counting on you. cafe so the guy can be like no people don't come here sorry about the other day the sidewalk cafe isn't as profitable as it used to be they just to hang out for the regulars good evening hero how about an espresso we hit the day my folk has left me his own dad and just did a beard if you see him tell him that he should take better care of his father don't tell my wife and Ornette that I've been spending my time here. <laughs> Wee! 
he probably that's probably where he we probably could have come back here and he would have been there uh as soon as we solved all the foresight problems hey maxwell hey long time no see uh, i've thought of a new joke since before knock knock who's there uh, sawyer sawyer who sawyer you're doing well i'm fine too bah ha 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 you don't think it's funny i really thought this would be funny to you now my self-confidence is totally shot back to therapy no i don't want to talk to you again The hint that I gave you a critical to helping you win. Happy, happy. We rock. <laughs> that guy. Oh, no, no, I don't want to walk. For there are important things to talk to in the desert. Plus, we might find a butterfly, and butterflies are always nice. <laughs> ah, such a young face. so long. <laughs> I should have purchased and consumed a bajillion skip sandwich deluxes. This is... The only time a diamond. Well, you take what you get. I'm a healer. You have certain lessons I'll be treated in the hospital. It's my job to carry you. Do you need some help? No. Somebody when it's necessary. Excuse me. Oh, I only found a diamond. What do you take? You take what you can get. Yeah, I'll say the same thing. The desert heat is clearly gone, Dave. Now a new day. Dessert time, I mean, not that, but uh, fuck it. Huh. Okay, I genuinely thought these people got, like, burned to a crisp at some point. I guess I am a fool. I guess so. There you are. Why would you feel like talking to Tiny Podcast? Uh, okay, you're not. You're not saying anything now. Not in that case. Uh... Again, I feel like we should be. S oh god, it's gonna put me in front of the the preschool, isn't it? Oh, thank god. No. Okay, good. Kidnapped is wrong. I can't believe kidnapped him. Says I'm pretty certain we're safe as long as I don't. All right, they're closed for a short period of time. As long as I don't actually go to the preschool. I just want to see if Everett drives back. Or 
where he walked off into the sunset forever or something. I also want to go to the happy, happy place. Nope, no way we're good. Uh, how the hell did I get to the happy, happy place? Right, right, I remember now. We also need to talk to Orange Kid. Apple Kid? Nope. You never finished your fucking machine. Did you come here to get your investment money back? Uh, no. Uh, can you wait a little longer? I promise I'll him a brilliant mention. I rely on your support even though I'm a super genius. Huh. I thought he actually gave, got... Uh, I guess that's my fault for just not remembering. I thought he actually did finish his invention during the game at some point. I guess not. It would have been, you know, so good, though, because you could spend, like, a handful of money. Oh, like, less money for a boiled egg than a fresh egg. Turn that boiled egg into a fresh egg. A fresh egg hatches, and it becomes a chicken and a chicken, and you make a lot of profit. More profit than otherwise. Did it take too long to get to Happy Happy Valley? What with uh, no encounters and the bridge being fixed? I'm shocked that the music actually changed here, though. It's pretty pleasant. Gonna friggin' fully put me to sleep. There we go. I am very bad at navigating this place. ahead of time and you finally have a chance to apologize the happy happy religious group has broken up this building is temporarily closed but I wanted to talk to car painter in a different way than before mr. car painter has become a very good man where is he I shouldn't be so desperate to chase after happiness. I had many footprints. I don't care. Next year's board over the years, food's in my business. Gone out of business due to personal reasons. Those personal reasons being. egg. <sighs> there he is! Hello! Oh, hey, Dean, it's been a long time since we last met. The whole town has woken up. The best happiness comes from being free. Your kids made me realize that. Good for you. Alright, I'm, I'm just gonna teleport even. I mean, more people could say something new, but heck it. That's fair, I probably should have talked to the cow. Oh, 
this in front of it directly and stuff. Let's see if I can not get lost this time. Yeah, yeah. I'm not naming him, just a regular mill. Is that gonna have side eye battle? No. The cow says, I have more respect for Mr. Car Painter than others. Even if he becomes someone's, even if I become someone's steak dinner, I'll still respect him. Hmm. Pretty sure that's the only cow here. Unless there's now a cow inside, uh. Sephra's old cage. No, no one here. Okay. Now well, we go back to own it. from the news, it's funnier than you. Frank probably says something. Frank's probably also at the burger shop, though. Considering that is where we found him, uh, and where he was praying. Yeah. I don't know what I expected. They're a real rainbow type guy. I don't think so. You sure are strong. You got me at least. Yeah. in such good condition can't be that cheap. I must be the happiest man in the world. I can make my jump at this same spot. Some hot melody. Hum sweet hum. Oh, that's the game.
But he still got credits after all. Check a burger shop. Uh, well, I guess we can talk to the mayor. I don't suspect he will say anything all that different, though. Oh, Damien, I saw a picture in the international newspaper of someone who looks like you. There's no way it was you. Maybe uh, you'd like to study my city management techniques so that you can become mayor someday. Wahaha. Since I returned peace to the town of Onet, I was re-elected mayor. Are you here to celebrate? No. Don't be so shy. A child should be so, shouldn't be so self-conscious. Thanks a lot. From this day forward until the day I die, Sneef, I will dedicate my life, Sneef, to the peace of Onet. Oh, boo hoo. Somehow I doubt that. The Boyga shop. And then the library. Frank is not here. Nope, oh, there he is. Hello, sure. How may I help you? Uh, aren't you Damie? After our battle, I became serious and I've been working very hard. I've even been doing some training for. for. well, a little bit of pro wrestling. It's the ring for me, baby. So you made it back alive. You must have many stories to tell. Let's get together for a drink. When you have a chance so I can hear your stories. I'm talking about drinking mineral water. I'm still in her age, you know. I'm sorry, what? How fucking old are you, Frank? Head to the scummy team, I guess so. God, yeah, high school did a number on him. The direct side to the east, east, the opposite of west. To who the library. I'd like to return the shyness book. Oh, finally, you've come to return the book. It seems like you finished it. You're such a good boy. As a reward, I'll give you a kiss. Smack! Ow. My face. <laughs> that was in two cents. I should, though. But that, I think that also required a bike. And I can't... I can't... It's soft locked with the bike. It's... Sephra is here. I can't ride my bike. I should go all the way back to the meteor, which I'm going to actually do because I want to go talk to Mr. Liar Exaggerate. Oh, well, that would work, yeah. Larden, are you. Larden is back. Salutations! You're the boy living next door. I heard that your family is in debt. Mrs. Minch told me about it. Well, live and learn. You just have to keep plugging away. As usual, you're wearing your grubbies. So what do you want? My son isn't home now. He's walking around somewhere. My husband is also gone. Oh yes, this is Mr. Pretty Man. He always has great advice. He's a real gentleman, he is. You'll be happy that you met him. Hey, Picky. I haven't seen you in a while. You look cool. I'm nowhere near as cool as you. I'm just average cool. Fair enough. Explode Lardino with our mind. Get revenge for Buzzbuzz. Buzz. Yeah, 
still got the power. I've got, I mean, you gotta see it here, but I've still got, you know, PSI. Yes. <laughs> Life is not that easy. You just saved the Earth from a crisis. Don't act so stuck up. When I was younger, I too saved the Earth many times. I live a modest life. That's the way it should be. Don't think. Don't you think a real hero is someone like me? No. Damie, don't be such a snob. Sure, someone like you who lies all the time. When I when, when you grow up, why don't you become my partner and we'll make lots of money? I'll be sure the first golden statue I find buried under my house, I'll give to you. like a big meteorite landed here not too long ago. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it really does depend on exactly the kind of gold statue. Like an Oscar? You know, fuck that. I'll chuck it at Largan's head or something. But yeah, I wish we could find like a Mami Mami statue. That was cool. Point being, it was awesome. Well, I could take the time to talk to literally everyone, but I don't want to. I really should go home. I shouldn't be out just wandering here and there. Don't you think so? No? Well, okay. I guess I would like to be with you a little longer. You've become such a strong young man. I'd like to hear all of your stories, but I don't want to annoy you as soon as you walk through the door. I want to have a chance to get to know your little girlfriend. It's good to meet you, Sephra. After all your chats with people you've met on the adventure... After all your chats with people you've met on your adventure are finally over, please come back here. The photo man brought an album by. I'd like to look at it with you. Other well, dogs haven't figured it out yet, but I know that you guys saved the world. I guess I should talk to my sister. Goody, my brother's back. You've got a lot of catching up to do with your schoolwork. York. If you have any problems with your assignments, I'll help you. Don't get freaked out. Did Us Cargo Express, my old company, help you? I saved some money, so we'll do the lunch thing sometime. You got also got a new girlfriend. Your adventure must have been pretty good. You need help with anything other than schoolwork? Yes. What do you want to do? Store everything. Jeff will never have this letter. Alright. Oh, I said take care. Head just looked out of my mouth. It's like I was talking to you when you were gone. I never did use the hand aid. Alright, Mom, I'm ready. You finished doing everything you wanted to. Yeah. Okay, now you can finally share your incredible experiences with me. You did so well. And 
Sephra never got to go home. And she never will. Get back upstairs, Tracy. This isn't for you. And there we have it. It was Earthbound. Now we got a cast. Picky Minch. Lardner Minch. Aloysius Minch. Pokey Minch. Buzz Buzz. Liar X Adjury. Frank. Frank Fly. The Sharks. Sharks. BH Pickle. Captain Strong. I guess we gotta talk to him, but heck of a though. The Annette Police Force. A diamond. Sephir's mom and dad. They never saw Sephir again, but there's Sephira. Orange Kid. The best mouse. Yeah, kid. Ever Mr. Everdread, sorry, I was almost almost impolite. The Runaway Five! Yeah, I mean, I love pretty much everything about this game. It is, I mean, outside of, like, the trees that explode, the happy happiest is <laughs> Carpenter. Because, just, yeah, I just love the game. It has Level Monkey, some, some annoyances here and there, but they do not really actually detract from anything. They're just annoying. Tony Maxwell, Tessie, and the Tessie Watching Club. Oh, they're finally watching Tessie. Brick Rib. Doctor and Donuts, Broken Sky Runner. But hey, it Danny. Mr. Saturn, boing zoom. Phase Distorter. Oh no, Belch. Master Belch, boing zoom. Lurp. George Montague. Gerardo Montague. Monkeys. Tala Rama. Tala Rama. Gildegard Monetary. Venus. And Pokey fled again. And there's Pooh. He's just Pooh. I don't know why they didn't. Pooh's Master and Star Master. Man K Man was the best. He wanted a king banana. Dungeon Man. Never worry. I can't believe Brick Road got fucking credited twice. Tinder Tribesman. Flying Man. Only one died. My entire courage. Generic NPCs. Dad and Finger. That's right, your father was a phone. Tracy, Damie, and Mom. But of course. There are. The Fuzzy Pickles. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Time for an instant memory. Say, Fuzzy Pickles! Wow, what a great photograph! Oh, it's an amazing song, yeah. Oh, so now we get to look at all of our photos that we took. Pretty sure I didn't get all of them. As many as I stumbled into, I'm sure there were more that I missed. Bum, bum, ba, ba. U.S. Conversion Director.
and just think if this were like a game on Steam these days, it'd be like, hey, achievement, get every horrible photo. Not oh, that bad, they're, they're neat, it's just, <laughs> there are so many of them. <laughs> allowed to emote except for Damy. Ghosts are there. There weren't any ghosts in this game. It's weird. Sorry, I, don't, I don't really have anything else to add to any of this. Hey, it's the Smiling Sphere. The one that explodes, probably. Because they all do. So I'm just staring at these photos. I'm like, yep. Yep, my tired face is just being like, yeah, photos. Listen to the good music. Pooh is there with us. Sampling voices. Shirakisato, Oke, Okesto, Itai, Shigesato, Yukari, Whistle Sight, I'm not sure what the whistle is. You know, Kazu Belch, oh my god, they actually sampled a guy for Belch. Makes sense. Just. That's a photo that could have had more people in it. I don't know why that one's a photo. I guess it is a big hotel. So if, we're, if you look at it from the cuts... If you look at if that and the restaurant from the uh, perspective of these are tourist memory pictures of sorts rather than... Uh, this is a screen cap of your adventure. <laughs> the producers wish to thank Michelle Artvision, Moonrider Offices, Cedric Inc., Cedric Co. Limited, Lucky Nice, Okubo Design Studio, On Associates, Sai Kobe, Ashura Office, Shoka, Shoka Kukan, Shinjo Sa, Coordinators. People doing things, a co producer? Oh. I didn't realize that uh, Miyamoto actually did have any connection to this at all beyond simply being in Nintendo. always gets me. And the player. Damien's Ganyan. <sighs> we did it though. Just uh, this, this is the freeze screen, isn't it? <laughs> no actual V end, it just freezes on the player. That name which I put in. So yeah, we done did it. A nice, relatively short playthrough. Oh, it's gone. Never mind. There's more. Fuck. 
fuck. Oh my god, is that my dad telling me I should stop playing? Oh my god. <laughs> It's your dad. You've been out there for a long time now. It may be none of my business, but don't you think it would be a good idea if you took a break? Yes, father, I do. All right. You should find a place to stay in the nearest town. When you get to the hotel, be sure to give your dear old dad a call. And hey, keep an eye out for the bad guys. They're all gone. Quick beep. <laughs> oh... <laughs> Oh, I have, I have the best luck. Ah, someone's knocking at the door. What an annoying knock. Yeah, I know. I've heard that knock before. Okay, I'm still level 79. So I just have the power to just explode the head of this person, whoever it is. Oh, my land! Who could be knocking at the door at this time of night? Oh, would you answer it? I got for these stuck in me dry. Something's gonna last still for now. Me. Who the fuck? Oh, no, it's a minch. A letter arrived from my brother, Pokey. It's addressed to Damie. There's no stamp. Uh, it's not time for the mailman to come. Anyway, I brought it over. It says, come and get me a loser. Spankity, spankity, spankity. <laughs> I wonder where he is. I mean, he's literally, like, outside, right fucking behind my house or something, I'm pretty sure. The end. Or is it? Okay, that's the freeze screen. Or is it? I don't know. I'm pretty sure that, that's the actual freeze screen. I forgot about that part. That teaser for New Game Plus slash Earthbound 2, which, no, it's not. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but yeah, a nice, relatively short playthrough. A good, uh, I, I felt it was really nice playing it again. I was happy to do that. Uh, I think I... <laughs> These didn't never went anywhere because never did come and get them. I mean, yeah, pretty much. But... I would do the same as Ness. You know, Pokey fucking shows up, you know, a letter from Pokey that, said, that ends in spankity, spankity, spankity. It's like, oh, God... I, I don't have time for this shit. I'm just gonna I'm gonna go back to bed, get the you know, get whatever sleep I can get after this, and just go to school or something. You know what? Especially considering, like you know, as the game progressed, Pokey, like, got larger and larger. So the problem will solve itself eventually, because it'll just, like, explode or something. Or implode. Oh, yeah. I kind of sort of know what we'll probably maybe play next. I've got, like, two or three things on my mind being like, oh, maybe that one, or maybe that one, or maybe that one. I'll, I'll make a decision come, you know, Sunday per usual. Tomorrow probably should be uh, Brock the Investigator, but it may not quite be. I haven't decided yet either, because I do have I do have another like what a thing that should be a one shot that I want to play, but I don't know. Anyway, thank y'all very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed Earthbound. I I very much enjoyed sharing it with y'all. And next time we'll see whatever the next thing is. Hello, well, <laughs> y'all have a great evening. And I will see you later. Good night. Boop.